Marth, uh, you know, he definitely does have good, um, you know, height capabilities as far as his up B goes, but that's all you need is that little push once that double jump is gone. You start to see, you start to see that struggle. Yeah. And that corner game is especially deadly. Yeah. Seen right. a lot of it today. So let's get it. We're going to have N26 and Daisuke versus Darklight and SK. Uh, I remember playing Daisuke at, at a tournament. He is, like, it, it was a pretty close match. And he's he going Mario at the same way. N26, I'm not familiar with him, nor Darklight and SK, but let's see what, 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 what we see here. We got a Mario and Rosa, Rosa combo and a Lucina and Schultz. Kind of keeping it a little separated, keeping that space. You know, uh, those gaps in that defense can be deadly, especially when you get, you know, pushed into that corner on that the two v one. You know, definitely rack up that damage. Oh yeah. Um, but I feel as though um, having a shell pushing a combo, with the grabs and the counters, and the there it is right there exactly. Like, that. like, like, like Lucina has all around kill power that's consistent and. He has the buster and he can just rack up damage and that and that's how they get the key comp. You know, Lucina is definitely one of those characters where you don't have that lag for those smashes, so that right. can just be so deadly, especially when you know, if she is on ground and you do have something coming, you can force that up beat, get that KO, and then have time to get away from the attack that's coming. Right. Um so we definitely have a, a push start. Um Yeah, blue, red team. Well, blue team dominating the red team. Oh, not quite. Well, yeah, dominating the red team right now. Yeah, Dark Light but and SK really kind of have uh, just even earlier with the throw, the um, Blood Brother team comp. Yeah. You so. know, they that predictability. They know what's going on. So. Haven't seen a lot of you know um, shell transfer power yet, but um, he's, you know he's got Buster. Right. Also, the Dice and, and and well, the red team they got to watch out on their shields because with, yeah, Dark Light he is. He is trying to break their shield, but that Luma is going to take that stop. Yeah, yeah, and that and that'll be the KO. first. And that's the first kill for, 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 for the red team. Red I feel, team is not out of this just yet. I feel for the longest time that people downplayed Luma but, um, and Rosalina, but having that second partner really opens oh, up yeah, the battle capabilities. Yeah. She can be deadly, it just like within that case right there. Very deadly. A nice yeah, seismic nice toss from yep. Daisuke. Almost had a spike. We were close, and he Ooh, got the ledge. There we are. That was nice. This is looking really bad for the red team. Okay, Dark Light getting rid of, getting rid of, rid of Luma. They definitely, um, you know, figured out in the single piece of this uh, who to isolate. Yeah. All right, we got a lot of airplay here. Yeah, not letting any of these guys land. Red Team is doing a good, a good job at that. Maybe they can get this kill on Shulk soon. Ooh, if Luma was still there, that probably would have been it. But unfortunately, missing the up smash, Shulk is still very much alive with the shield Monado, and Shulk saved Rosalina. We were close, we were close. That's not going to be the end of Shulk. He, he's living nice and tense. And there we are. But the up B, oh. that's not going to take it just yet. Just but that yet. is the end of Luma for sure. And oh my god, Shulk is. We're getting a lot of cover play from Daisuke. He's definitely keeping them off the grounds. So and when, you know, Rosalina does lose Luma, she has that ability to come back. Right. Uh, up air finally taking the shot. stock at 190 Two something. And now, okay, this is looking for. for Got pretty the 136 more off Lucina. Yeah, for the game is looking more even. It is looking very more doable for, for the red team. But they gotta watch out for SK with his smash, with smash art on deck. You know, and Shulk definitely has a lot of play-by-play -play area. Um, you know, you can cover uh, a vast expanse of the map, especially with the Sword Extend. With that, with that smash and uh, you know, let's see where this goes. Situation. Daisuke had a lot of good crowd control this map, but... Uh, let's, let's see what, what he can do, do from here. There's going to be a lot of quick sword play here. He's going to have to definitely have the patience to dodge. He needs some poke, too. He's got the smash map. He's got, yep. Yeah, you got to watch out. Oh, he doesn't nah. have to jump. You know, that was definitely a good first match. Yeah. Um, I feel one, like, uh, uh, you're saying? Uh, with, um, you know, Shulk's first ability in regard to his powers, I feel like, uh, you know, people don't utilize those the way they should. So when you see, it, you know, that higher tier Shulk player utilize the power, um, you know, especially uh, just even heading down to the void, jumping back up like that, almost getting that KO. Right. You know, um, that can make the difference. And, and I really think that, uh, you know, him activating that buster early on and racking up that damage and then going for his smash really, uh, uh, you know, prove to get those KOs. Oh, yeah, that was the, the, I love their team synergy, Lila, like you said, like everything you just said, I love that team synergy, but we're getting a, two character switches. Dice Gate going to Cloud and Darklight going Falco because of it.
Like he switched to Cloud first, then he switched to Falco. This is interesting. Why? Why he? Why no? Wait, no, wait, no, 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 no. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Di both Daisuke and and N26 change. Daisuke switched to Cloud and N26 going from Rosa to Falco. You know, um, interesting. Being pretty new on the scene here, as far as this stream goes, um, you uh, you know, I don't know a lot of the players yet, so it's really interesting to see how they um, you know, play. Um, and the, you know, the beautiful thing about Smash um, and all these players is with each character comes a different team comp and comes a different play style. You know, some people are naturally aggressive, but some of the characters just don't have the ability to output damage like that. So you have to change your play style up. But, um, it looks like we did have a Cloud Falco switch. Yeah, let's, um, see. let's see what they can do with this team. I really think it was probably good for them to stay Lucina and uh, yeah. keeping up on, uh, yeah. on Shulk. If it isn't broken, don't fix it. That's what I always say. Okay. Red team getting sandwiched yep, right getting now. a lot of early damage. We got a buster out. This really starts to shine. Oh yeah. That's when their team cop really starts to shine. Okay, that, he was expecting an up throw from, from Lucina, but missing it just slightly. Nice up tilt. Alright, that's got a buster limit pull. Perfect example right there, which is him so, like, without even blinking, being able to switch to jump. And we got a KO from uh, Over Smash from Falco, but just him being able to switch to that jump and come back to the to the arena every time, it's just yeah. incredible. Yeah, it is nice. A red team is actually looking better in this match already. Taking the, the lead. Let's see if they can keep it. Ooh, that soft spike. have a little bit of greed. Yeah. That was a nice soft spike on, on Lucina. If she did not have her All jump, right. that would have been it. Perfect and lag from Lucina, but then the pullback from Falco. So red team is still in, in the lead by, by one stock. So they're definitely they made the right right adjustments. They made the right the right adaptions. So you know, kudos. You know, it, it, it just how crazy smashes. You know, I just I never like to count any of this stuff out. Right. So now we're we're back to, to an even game. Let's see what combo. Probably a little early you know? for him to pull out the shield, yeah. but uh, you know. I, th I think he was trying to go go go, go for Buster, but then he got hit and he was stuck in force to go into. I'm not. I'm pretty sure when. When you're trying, when you're switching through Monados, once you get hit, you whatever Monado you're stuck is, on. Yeah, yeah. You, you're just stuck there. One thing I haven't seen from SK though is uh, any counterplay. Um, you know, I really feel like Shulk's counterplay is really deadly. Uh, you know, granted as time goes on, I'm using more, it slows down. But uh, that versatility with his beam sword, getting to catch yeah, yeah. everyone, it can be pretty deadly. And in close quarters matches like this and high percentages, I really think that could get you a double KO or prove to get you a KO. Yeah, and also a uh, good. A good, a good strat with the counter is your own partner doing a powerful smash attack. They had such a, like they had such a wide range. They could get a, a double lot, from but Lucina. that up B from Lucina can do just the same. We definitely had a lot of uh, control from uh, Cloud and Falcolo for a couple minutes, so I really thought uh, you know they'd keep them hammering over there. But just versatility pulled them right out. We did lose a Shulk. Um, I wouldn't say it's neck and neck, but it's still pretty close. If they can get that Lucina oh, stock, they're definitely in the game. That's something you do not want. You do not like to see, but that stuff happens, and you just got to roll, roll, roll with it. Now we're going to get tons of damage with definitely the Buster yeah, and Lucina. Ooh, okay, letting go of shield at the wrong time. Okay, this is this is Cloud. He has he does have have the ability to bring this back, but let's see if Dice K can, can utilize it. He got quite a bit of tilt though. Um, you know he's definitely got a good poke, uh, whereas they don't. I think it'd be a good idea to utilize that, but we'll yeah. see where he pulls with it. But there's oh, the, the team comp. Throw, Always throw. the team comp. What a yeah. beautiful move. And I believe that's it. Two zero. I think we probably took five KOs from a throw up from that Lucina combo. Yeah, which is actually a pretty good, a pretty good.